Shout out to Rock, baby. <laughs>
a little far out because if we have to, we can shim this uh, toe kick out of here just so it lines up flush. That was something we didn't really think about from the jump. Yeah. I mean, if you would have, if we would have brought the bench a lot more in, you could angle in, you know, trim in or something like that. But, you know, we decided to do that. Well, we figured we had to do that. That's pretty much it for the most part. It's nice and secure, solid. Now we're just going to ship lap up to our finished surface or rough surface. And then we'll put our slab on later, stain it, whatever. We might pre-stain it before we put it down and glue it down or something. That's pretty much it for that. And now it's time to just ship lap it, get it ready for the top. All right, we're done ship lap, nickel gapping. It's not ship lap. Um, oh, that's fake news. Yeah. So what I did was I held it up a little bit since we're going to be meeting our toe kick. What's nice is with the vinyl floor, my floor guy will be able to put the vinyl underneath the cabinets and that, and I won't have to run a piece of cord around at all. Famous last words. Um, but we're all good to go. We got, you know, paint it, caulk it, uh, putty the holes. Still got to put the butcher block on and stain it. Still got a million things to go, but we're ready to go. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it for now until we come back with the butcher block and paint and everything. So it turned out pretty good, I think. Yeah, it looks nice. I think it's gonna be a nice piece. Yeah. All right, Mike, do you think you cut it right? Yeah. Nah, close enough. And how are you gonna attach it? I mean, we're gonna do a dry fit here, but what's I'm gonna the- I'm gonna liquid nail the hell out of it. And then do we screw it down at all, or we just- uh, Nah, I think I'm gonna put a couple 15 gauge trim nails in it. I'm just gonna liquid nail the shit. I don't think it's gonna, hopefully it won't go anywhere, so. Right. Thing's pretty heavy and big, uh, you know. All right, let's see if Mike measured it. John, put your end in. Now I gotta put my end in first. Oh my god. Can't believe that. Yeah, it's good. There we go. It's a tight fit. A little persuasion. Pretty good for a plumber. I mean, I think I'm gonna live with it. Yeah, it looks nice. This is a nice little bench. Yeah, who thought of this? <laughs> I got the interior design eye, dog. We glued it down. It was a little off in the back. We put a shim on it. We'll let it set up. Uh, I don't think we're gonna nail it. We're gonna see what happens once the glue sets up real good. We put a generous amount down. I spent the big bucks and then we'll let it, we'll seal it, we'll, we'll stain it, seal it, whatever we want to do after that. Probably should have done it before, but it's time to see what it would look, look like, so. It's installed and uh, we got to fill up putty holes and then we're going to have a grate that covers that AC area, right? Yeah. All right, give us a thumbs up. 